Hello everyone and welcome to the first episode of Race Face Driver Updates in 2020. I'm Brittany Lung. We are deep in Speed Week's competition where we have Jesse Love and Connor Mosak running the World Series of Asphalt at New Smyrna and Jake Bullman running Winter Nationals at Citrus County Speedway. Jesse Love in night one of competition, running in the super late model division, started in the fifth position and finished in the eighth position. On night two, he started second and got the lead to capture his first victory of Speed Weeks. Jesse then continued his good run by starting fourth and finished fourth on night three. On night four, he would make his ARCA Menard Series East debut, driving the number 19 for Bill McNally Racing, where he finished in the 12th position. Connor Mosak is participating in the Pro Late Model Division at New Smyrna as a part of the World Series of Asphalt Series. On night one, Connor started on the pole where he was able to hold strong at the front to finish in the second position. On night two, he started in second position and finished in the fourth position. For night three, Connor started in the fifth position and finished in third, continuing his top five streak, and he leads the points heading into night five. Caden Honeycutt started his season off in his USRA Limited Dirt Modified at RPM Speedway. Caden started last in his heat race and brought home a second placed finish. In the A main, he started seventh, but was caught up in the big one when the leader spun on lap three while running third. Caden had to restart at the tail end of the field, but raced his way back to a second place finish. Jake Bullman started running the Winter Nationals at Citrus County Speedway in the Young Lions division. He was in the first feature of the day and finished in the third position. In his second feature of the day, Jake started second and came home in the second position. Jake, Connor, and Jesse continued to run their respective divisions for the start of the 2020 season, and we look forward to bringing you the rest of the results on the next episode of Race Face Driver Updates. That's it for this week's Race Face Driver Updates, and remember, if you've missed any of our shows, you can get caught up at raceface.tv on demand. Don't miss Race Face Spotlight on Thursdays at 10 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. As always, we encourage you to support local racing in your communities. Don't forget to follow us on social media. We will be back next week with more from your favorite race face drivers. So go out there and have a great race week. I'm Brittany Lung. Thanks for watching.